I'm Susan Evans from SusanEvans.org and today we are going to make a saturated solution of sugar water and salt water. We are using Christian Kids Explore Chemistry by Bright Ideas Press to do these experiments. Okay now, um, what we are doing is we are putting one a teaspoon of sugar into there and stirring it. Okay, you're going to put one teaspoon of salt into there. Go ahead and start stirring it. Okay, and then we are going to continue putting them in. Go ahead and stir. Okay, so at first it's not saturated. Go ahead and stir it. Okay, so you see that it's cloudy, but it's all dissolved. Okay, so let's do another one for salt and another one for sugar, another one for sugar, another one for salt. Okay, so you continue stirring and if you, if it's all dissolved and there's nothing, no grains on the bottom, then it's still not saturated. It, the solution is saturated when it holds the most that it can possibly hold and that it's got some grains on the bottom. I think that's what's happening in your one finally. In your one too. Okay, let's do it on the second one now. So let's go ahead and put some in there. Go ahead and put it in here. Okay, go ahead and stir it. You want to put the spins in? Go ahead, I'll stir it. Okay, now comes the fun part. Okay, with your eyes closed, kids, okay, go ahead and close your eyes, and I am going to shift these around so you do not know which is which. Now, actually, it looks like some don't say, but it looks like uh, some of them are clear and some of them are... Um, Let's see, no, they're definitely saturated. Okay, so now um, each of you can um, smell. Okay, so smell, go ahead and smell. Um, is this sugar or salt? salt? Do you know? Salt and yes. Okay, we labeled the bottom of each of these before we started with masking tape and black marker. Okay, so you can smell it. And what's these, this? these two are sugar. Okay, so, so you smell it. You can also taste it briefly. Um, woo, salt water. Oh my goodness, the ocean. Okay. And then, woo, woo, and then the sugar one, taste it. Okay, so each of these are saturated solutions because we have put uh, sugar and salt to the extent that it was so saturated it could not hold any more sugar or salt. I'm Susan Evans from SusanEvans.org. Thanks for watching our saturated solutions.